Hey, what is up guys? Oblivious here, and today we're finally going to be doing a Black Ops 3 video. I know the trailer came out, like the teaser trailer, whatever it was for like the, um, the campaign and the multiplayer and stuff like that, came out a little bit ago, and it's obviously, I, I haven't even made a video confirming that the next game was Black Ops 3. My last, I think my last Call of Duty video was actually like, which game is going to be either like World of War 2 or Black Ops 3, but finally, we got confirmation it's going to be Black Ops 3. I know I'm a little late, but I just wanted to talk about it because it's a big part of my channel. It's going to be a huge part of my channel once the game comes out because I am actually very, very excited for the game just because of a few things that I've been hearing about it and stuff like that because the last two years, I've been going basically two years and I really have not played that much Call of Duty like as I usually would because like Black Ops 2 I played the shit out of and all the games with all the Call of Duties before that, I completely played the crap out of like oh god I got so much enjoyment out of all those and then Ghost kind of came along, I mean had fun with that at the beginning and then it got, just towards the end, just kind of, kind of like boring and repetitive, and just, just annoying in general, just for a bunch of different reasons and stuff like that. Advanced Warfare, I can't really put my finger on exactly how I feel about the game. It's kind of like I like it, but then I kind of like also hate it at the exact same time. I know it's kind of weird, but like certain aspects of the game, I like honestly, I just do not really enjoy that much. Kind of like the X, the whole like instillment of the um exo suit and stuff like that and the exo abilities like first of all i don't even i've never used an exo ability like in this whole game i feel like it's honestly a waste of space and i just use like two grenades or something like that or extra perks usually it's extra perks but um i don't even use that and the exo like boost thing and stuff like that i know it's easier to get around and they actually did do a good job on like the size of the maps and stuff like that but i don't know i feel like it, i'm constantly having gunfights where i'm trying to like fucking shoot a bird out of the sky and it's really it's just completely away from like traditional call of duty which is what everyone's used to and what everyone enjoys but let's actually get into black ops 3 some of the things that are like confirmed and us kind of up in the air and kind of like what about new features in the game and stuff like that so first of all i heard that um the camo system you can like use the camos that they give you like in every other call of duty and stuff like that but then you can also edit certain parts of the camo of like you can make your own kind of stuff and like make your own designs like you can want, like tiger print like n muzzle or something like that i don't even know i don't know exactly how it works but i know there is some type of editing system in the like the camos and stuff like that and there's i assume there's also going to be like um editing player cards again like there was in black ops i know there actually was an advanced warfare but i never actually did it like i think i did it one time i made like the kermit frog drink and lift an iced tea and that was really it but um i remember in black ops 2 and black ops 1 i made like a lot of like me and my friends would honestly just like okay 20 minutes make the best emblem you possibly can and we would just do that and like judge and which one was the funniest or anything like that but it was pretty fun and then also one of the other things which i am super fucking excited about is going to be zombies i mean they kind of talked about it and then they actually had a trailer for it but like in the original teaser i think halfway through they sh sh quickly showed like a zombie kind of like running at the screen like screaming like the normal like zombie like or whatever it was and it was fucking awesome i was like oh my god literally fucking sitting there just my fucking pants and I was like, oh, sweet Jesus, finally back to the final, like, the back, the normal fucking zombies, which I know might not still, I don't even, in Black Ops 2, I don't even know if it, was it still Nazi zombies, even though it was in the future? I honestly didn't really, I actually played a lot of, never mind, I played a lot of fucking zombies in that game, but I don't really know if it was Nazi zombies per se, but they're actually going back to the zombies, fuck Extinction, fuck Exo, actually Exo zombies, a lot of people are saying that's actually very good, I actually, I, I haven't bought the DLC and you already even played it at all. But I actually heard, like, from a lot of people, it was actually solid anyway. But, um, one of the other things, you now, here's, we're talking more about the multiplayer now. One of the things is that the EXO, kind of like, I'm talking Advanced Warfare kind of EXO, there's not that in the game where you can just, like, could constantly tap A and, like, be jumping and stuff and just dashing, sprinting everywhere all around. I hear that 90% of, like, the gunfights and stuff like that that you actually get into are going to be like traditional call of duty where it's like 1v1 on the foot or on feet or anything like something like that and only like and the way they said the the way someone i watched like a video actually on it about like ex the exosuit explained it, it's kind of it's not called an exosuit anymore but it's called something similar to that and um it's more like you you can start running and then like press a and then your guy like boosts for a little bit but then over time it kind of like gradually like gets lower and lower and then it kind of has to like get to redo it and stuff like that and then for jumping i hear you can like jump and then tap a again and you kind of like jump but then you like glide a little bit but then you just kind of go back to the ground but i hear it's actually not that bad of like a thing and it's actually like it's not dominating the game or anything like that it's like it's kind of just like normal call of duty which actually makes me very fucking happy because i won't have to be constantly aiming at the sky and like swooping around corners and just checking like this like as opposed to just normal call of duties where i can check like corners of the room i don't have to check like the roof and shit and everything like that which is kind of annoying and another thing which is the best thing the new the best news i've heard all day is that there is not going to be like very strict skill based matchmaking in um black ops 3 which makes me super excited because all my friends who have played this game and I, even me obviously 
I hate, like, I, I, I know it's, like, weird. I just don't like super competition when I'm trying to play Call of Duty. I want, like, where I can actually do very good in Call of Duty. Capture because that's the, the funnest way to play, basically. And, like, when, when I'm constantly playing people, like, you said, are super try hard like me, and constantly like, doing, like, the things I talk about with the exosuits, like, super jumping and whatnot, and just kind of doing the trying to hit that. And they're very try hard, and, like, you never, if you don't give 100% all the goddamn time, you're gonna get scraped, and it's kind of annoying that I have to constantly do that. And one thing is, like, I had a series on Black Ops 2 where I made, like, 20 to 25 videos about, like, certain Black Ops 2 Enemy subscriber challenges, and I was not really able to do that many on Advanced Warfare. For the simple fact that they were, like, impossible to do. If I tried to do it in there was one kid who was, like, literally me, Enemy just playing, he was trying his ass off with, like, an ASM1, it was, like, literally impossible to Doing, like, a challenge that, like, completely hinders me, my ability to play like that. But, in Black Ops 3, it's going to be more like the Black Ops 2. And also there's going to be a beta, the first ever beta, I think there was actually one more, but there's the, it's going to be the first ever beta, basically, they're beta, basically, recent launch from a call of duty, which I'm super excited about, obviously we're going to see a strap on gameplay, but I'm not sure how it works, like how many hours of the gameplay you get, obviously there's going to be restricted classes and stuff, guns even though it's stuff like that, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you did, and you have any comments about Black Ops 3, comment them in the below, I want to have a fucking conversation with you, because I'm very excited if you can't. Leave a like on this video, subscribe, see more Black Ops 3.